I think we did a fantastic job in Puerto Rico. We're still helping Puerto Rico. The governor is an excellent guy, and he is very happy with the job we've done. We have put billions and billions of dollars into Puerto Rico, and uh, it, it was a very tough one. Don't forget, their electric plant was dead before the hurricane. If you look back on your records, you'll see that that plant was dead, it was shut, it was bankrupt, it was out of business. Uh, they owed tremendous amounts of money. They had it closed up. And then when the hurricane came, uh, people said, what are we going to do about electricity? That wasn't really the hurricane. That was gone before the hurricane. But we've, we've put a lot of money and a lot of effort into Puerto Rico. And I think most of the people in Puerto Rico really appreciate what we've done. You know, Texas healed quickly. And the people were incredible. Florida healed quickly, and everybody worked very hard. Puerto Rico was actually more difficult uh, because of the fact it's an island. It's much harder to get things onto the island. With Texas, you're land-based. With Florida, you're land-based. Puerto Rico is a very difficult situation. I only hope they don't get hit again, because they were hit by two right in a row, and really the likes of which we have never seen before. But the people of Puerto Rico are great people. They work very hard. But Puerto Rico, I would say, would, was by far the most difficult of the group. And, you know, right now, FEMA and all of the people that work so hard there, they were very brave, and they have done some job. But Puerto Rico had a lot of difficulties before it got hit. And we're straightening out those difficulties even now.